Hopefully my cat doesn't just start meowing, okay? It already is. It's gonna ruin this whole thing. I can't wait to move. Uh, I don't even want to film with the cat meowing. It's good. Alright, so unfortunately I had a whole list of, I was filming yesterday, okay? I knocked out all this shit, right? Cleaning all the big snakes, cool stuff. So you, I knocked out all this stuff for you guys, unfortunately. I just got a new microphone, an external mic. And so yeah, hooking up the external microphone. I forgot to turn it on and everything I filmed. It had no noise. I'm gonna be moving soon. You can tell I'm really happy about the situation right now because I'm tired of dealing with the cat in this small little area, okay? I got a lot of stuff to do. I'm trying to film and the cat won't shut up. I need more space so I can put the cat away. With that being said, we're gonna try and force feed. Not force feed, we're gonna assist feed the small red-tailed green rat snake. Because it needs to eat. See, I tried leaving two pinky mice in here and it did not eat. What are you doing? Hanging out upside down? So what I'm going to do is just get this guy to stay up here. Yeah, so unfortunately she's still not eating. I'll put the food up to her and she'll, you can kind of like see her change position. She won't strike at the food. Usually doesn't happen. Usually he'll get it. I need to get him unwrapped off my hand. So this is the first pinky mouse, so I'm gonna get one more pinky <laughs> I'm gonna get one more pinky mouse in her after she gets this down. <clears throat> you see once I get it in her mouth, usually she'll just chew it down no problem. So she doesn't have an issue eating, but for some reason she just won't go after the food. Even when you just annoy her with it, you know what I mean? You actually got to try and pry her mouth open then get it in. But annoying her with it, even like with the tongs or in her tub or anything, trying to hold her, I'll try and hold her up and then just like um, annoy her with it while holding her, still won't take it. So for some reason, assist feeding is the only option. Um... I would find this way to be easier than a pinky pump right now, honestly. I do think I want to get one of those pinky pumps that you put pinky pinky mice in it just squishes it up and makes soup or whatever. So I would definitely like to try one of those. I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, I just haven't got around to it yet. So I think that would definitely help. I would like to put her down without freaking her out too much. Locked on to target right now. <laughs> so you can see the other mouse in here going down. So 
So I'm going to use the hook just to kind of help her push it down. Kind of something just to go over. You see what I mean? <laughs> trying to help you so yeah this is my only red tailed green rat snake um, she's obviously captive bred actually I bought her captive born and bred CBB um, I don't know if it was born U.S. or born uh, overseas and then imported, but she's doing all right. You know what I mean? She had mites when she came in. I had to get rid of those. Um, you know, I haven't seen any ticks or anything, so as far as I know, that's all right. She's been doing all... I've had her a while now, so I would think anything trying to suck her blood is... is um, you know, she's consistently doing better. She's still shedding, you know, with assist feeding her. Um, so she's doing all right, you know what I mean? She's definitely not horrible condition, but she's just not eating. All right, last one, okay? Little pinky mouse. Last meal. Okay. Eat it, we can be done. Bam. Okay. Getting it down. Perfect. So these are the meals I've been sticking with. I notice I've been able to get two down. So every time I assist feed her, I, I get get the two. And then um Yeah. Two pinky mice once a week is doing the trick for right now I could probably do more but I'm not so this works I right, know she's done I want to set her back in her tub all right so I'm pretty happy with that okay successful assist feeding can't go wrong This back's oh shit. So you don't bite me. There you go. Alright, Miss Ozzy. So two live pinky mice. So I don't really notice the difference. It's the same to me when I'm assist feeding pinky mice, whether they're frozen thawed or live, it doesn't matter. So might as well just do the live if they'll take it. I'll just assist you in that just so it's I feel like that's better for them when they're not eating either way. I also had 